Petra-chan saw it. My name is Tokusa, and this is my co-worker, Kuroki. Kuroki is a very capable guy. He's on another level when it comes to calculating or memorizing things. You're so smart, Kuroki. What college did you go to? Uh, Harvard. Harvard? Holy crap! It's nothing, man. I'm not that smart. He's so modest. Gotta get back to work. Kuroki had amazing skills, but he lacked confidence. By the way, he also has this other side of him. Oh, it's thundering outside. Ah! Whoa there, you all right, Kuroki? Oh, uh, sorry. I'm scared of lightning. He was afraid of loud sounds. Where is he? Our clients are about to arrive soon. Hey, Kuroki, where are you right now? Oh, sorry. I made a mistake at the station and got on a train heading the opposite direction. What? And he had his issues outside of the office, but... What the hell? How do I fix this? I'll check it for you, Tachibana. Another day. Ugh, those files I need for the conference. I'll prepare them for you. Nice. Thanks, Kuroki. <laughs> Kuroki was very accurate and speedy. He also always volunteered to help, so our boss thought very highly of him. One day... Kuroki, I have some good news for you. What is it, sir? What do you think of this girl, Kuroki? Wow, she's beautiful. Who's this girl? Yeah, she's very pretty. <laughs> right? This is my niece. She's beautiful, right? And she's not married yet. What do you say, Kuroki? You want me to set you guys up? What? Uh, are you sure? Someone like me? Yeah, of course. I know you have what it takes to make her happy. <laughs> oh, that's so great. Congratulations, Kuroki. I'm so jealous that you get to be matched with such a pretty girl. So Kuroki and our boss's niece, Yuzuriha, met for the first time. My uncle has told me all about you. I heard that you're a very capable worker. I'm glad that you seem so nice. <laughs> no, he's just exaggerating. Yuzuriha seemed to like Kuroki, and they decided to get married shortly after. <laughs> Congratulations, Kuroki. I'm so happy for you. Here, have some coffee. Yeah, thanks. Yuzuriha is so nice. She's so classy and talks so smoothly, and she's so pretty. Uh, I don't know if I'm good enough for her. Hmm. Oh, here we go again. Have some confidence, man. Yeah, you're kind of a scaredy cat, but you're so capable. Plus, you're a gentle and empathetic person. I'm sure you'll be able to make Yuzuriha happy. <laughs> yeah, I'll do everything I can to make her happy. Yeah, let me know if you ever need someone to talk to, all right? And so, six months later, they became husband and wife. How's the new marriage working out? You having fun? Oh, yeah, it's fun. Good for you, Kuroki. However, gradually, Kuroki's expression changed. It was like a shadow that kept getting bigger. Kuroki, have you been eating properly? You look pale, son. Uh, yes, I'm fine, sir. I just need more sleep, that's all. <sighs> Hey, Kuroki, something wrong at home? Huh? Oh no, everything is fine. There's something off. He's hiding something from me. Three days after that conversation, I guess I'll take a leak and head home. Man, Kuroki seemed pale again today. I hope he's okay. <gasps> hey, you okay? Are you feeling sick? I'm... Fine. Uh, uh. Kuroki? You sure you don't need to see a doctor? Yeah, I'm fine. <sighs> Kuroki, you're keeping something inside you, aren't you? You've been acting weird ever since you got married. Uh, uh, uh. Hey! Kuroki? I knew it. Something's going on, right? You can trust me. Tell me everything. Kuroki confessed everything to me after that. Just as I suspected, Tachibana's niece, Yuzuriha, was the root of the problem. From the first day that I got married... Kuroki... Huh? Huh? Who's that guy, Yuzuriha? 
Let me introduce to you to my boyfriend, Hideki. Hey, nice to meet you. Huh? What? I've been dating him for two years now. <laughs> so, it'll be the three of us living together from now on. You better keep your mouth shut about this. Wait, why? I thought we just got married today. <gasps> Don't you see what's going on, you idiot? You're our slave from now on. Just go make the bread and dedicate your life to us. Let's go to bed, Yuzuriha. <laughs> yeah. Ever since then, I had no place in that house. Whenever I go back, I get beaten. So I've been sleeping on park benches lately. I don't want to go back there. You... You idiot! Why were you keeping all this a secret? Because... I really like this company. I thought that I would lose my place here, too. Plus, it's Mr. Tachibana's niece, so... Ah, I see. That devil. She was taking advantage of your quirky niceness. <sighs> Trust me, Kuroki. You have to report all of this to the boss. And get away from that girl immediately. But... No buts. Do it now. Just start collecting evidence for the divorce and be prepared to run. I do have pictures and audio, but I don't want to be fired. Are you crazy? Not a chance. Plus, it's the company that needs you, not the other way around. Trust me. Okay. So Kuroki decided to proceed with the divorce. All parties involved were notified and gathered for a meeting. Kuroki and his parents, our boss Tachibana, his niece Yuzuriha, the boyfriend Hiragi, Yuzuriha's parents, and Kuroki's uncle Katsura, who was a lawyer. On top of that, Kuroki's parents were important people in a giant company that our company was doing business with. He said that his older brother is a doctor who identified evident signs of domestic abuse, too. Damn, what an elite family. I guess he was just insecure because he comes from such a capable bloodline. I am so sorry. I'm so sorry, sir. It was all my fault for introducing my niece to Kuroki. I'm so sorry. I didn't think my daughter was capable of such a thing. I'm so embarrassed. I don't have the words to express my apologies. Kuroki, I'm so sorry to you as well. I didn't know my niece was this kind of girl. Please, Mr. Tachibana, stop apologizing, sir. Kuroki is right. You aren't the ones who owe us an apology. It's you two, Yuzuriha and Hiragi. I've been a lawyer for quite a while now, and I know that I shouldn't be mixing work with my private life. But after what you did to my beloved nephew, you should both be prepared for hell. <laughs> and so, Kuroki's elite lawyer uncle squeezed the maximum payment out of the two, and Kuroki was able to successfully get his divorce. Kuroki respected his boss and refused to let anything happen to him, so Tachibana was untouched. According to Tachibana, the neighbors found out about what happened, and Yuzuriha is treated like the devil by all of her neighbors now. Mommy, look, it's a demon! Hey, don't get near her! Apparently she broke up with her boyfriend, too, who also got fired from his job. We should have noticed earlier, too. Sorry about that, Kuroki. No, don't say that. It was my fault. Kuroki? Oh, yeah, I should have told you guys earlier. That's what I'll do from now on. Yeah. Kuroki, if your stomach is feeling better, want to go out for some drinks? Yeah, count me in. Kuroki gradually returns to his old self. Three years passed, and Kuroki married a girl named Yuri, who his uncle introduced him to. Hey, Kuroki, nice. That looks delicious. Did your wife make that for you? It's so good. <laughs> so I wanted to take Yuri out, but where do you think I should take her? You should ask your wife where she wants to go. Oh, you're right. That's what I'll do. It looks like things are going well this time. What a relief. Good for you, Kuroki. ご視聴いただきありがとうございました。その人の性格に付け込んで奴隷のように扱うだなんてひどすぎる話です。少しでもおかしいなと感じたら、徳佐さんのように好印かもしれませんけど、問い詰めることって大事なのかもしれません。親身になってくれる人がいるなって人柄の良さから寄ってきてくれるものなんですかね皆さんはどう感じましたかコメント欄に書いていただけると嬉しいですまた無事に離婚ができてよかったと思った方
チャンネル登録と高評価をお願いいたします。